Why promise to cancel student debt when no one meant it? Labour MP blasted on pledge BBC host John Pyar slated a Labour frontbencher for defending Jeremy Corby over his student debt pledge. In a heated clash, Pyar asked Shadow Women and Equalities Minister Sarah Champion if she thought mischievous commentators had whipped up a storm over Mr Corby's alleged promise the party was co-utally reported as saying it would scrap tuition fees and debt ahead of the general election which helped attract a huge number of youth votes and earn the party a number of new MPs speaking on Pyar's politics on the BBC. Pyar asked, just tell me this, because it's bothering me a little bit. Why promise to cancel student debt in the election campaign when no one really meant it? Ms Champion tried to hit back and said no promise had been made John you're better than that, you know that that wasn't a promise. It wasn't in our manifesto, she said but Pyar jumped in once again and said Mr Corby had made the pledge I do remember Jeremy Corby saying that was the idea, he said the clash continued as Ms Champion denied Mr Corby said he would cancel the debt she said, I can bore you by quoting it. He was asked about people who already have the debt. He said, and I quote, I'm looking at ways we can reduce that, ameliorate that lengthen the period of paying it off or some other means of reducing the debt. So the simplest way is to get it down from 6.1% interest. He definitely did not say he was going to cancel the debt. The BBC host was not finished and questioned where the comments had come from he asked, so the £100 billion costed idea of getting rid of people's debt. You think that was just whipped up by mischievous commentators. Trying to defend the party leader once again, the MP for Rotherham said, well it was never said. I've got all of the quotes from that point forward and it was never said. It is not in our manifesto. Jeremy did not say that. In June, ahead of the vote, Jeremy Corby spoke on student loans which saddles some adults with upwards of £20,000 debt the Labour leader said he would deal with it he told NME, yes, there is a block of those that currently have a massive debt, and I'm looking at ways that we could reduce that, ameliorate that, lengthen the period of paying it off, or some other means of reducing that debt burden. The comments came after Labour generated a huge swell of student support when they made a manifesto promise to scrap tuition fees, which increased to £9,000 a year under the coalition government in 2012. But speaking on BBC's Andrew Marr show on Sunday, Mr Corby said he never meant the party would abolish current debts as they had no idea how much it would cost thanks for watching, please like. Share and don't forget to subscribe English News Hub for new excited videos.